Trips now go to the left side. Thomas the single back. Hillis now get to play. He'll go to his line and, and bark out signals. Play clock at 12. And he'll wait to snap. And he hands it up the middle. He's looking to get off that left tackle, and he'll be hit. He'll fall forward for two yards. Yeah, it looks like the uh, outside of the field is open because we have got those receivers, those trips running down the field, so it's open. Uh, Thomas continues to cut it up, get positive yardage. And he's going to pick up. They're going to give him maybe three. We'll call it a, a long seven, third and seven. And now they'll line it up tight formation. And they fake the handoff. Hill is looking to throw, and he's got a receiver. That's done. Done. And he's done. down the sideline. He'll have the first down. Don't see no laundry. No laundry on the field. He's going to gain about 15 yards. We're in to Red Devil territory already. He will go out of bounds. It will be at the 45-yard line of Lawrence County. Tigers on the move here early. If you're just joining in the first quarter. Cover we have Dale. no score, 10.35 remaining here in the quarter. The train checks out, Coverdale checks in. Coverdale and had 175 yards last week. I think it was 175 yards on 25 carries, had four touchdowns. Wow. Uh, he, he picked up the pace for career, the train. Career day right yeah. there. The train was a little hobbled last week. So he, he was, and he now Hillis will tonight. hand it to him. He's working off the right side. And he's got positive yardage set, maybe six, seven yards. Very good one-two punch. Coverdale seems to hit the hole a little faster. He's not as big. And maybe a little easier to bring down than the train, uh, but two different running styles, and so the defense has has to adjust to those. Well, one and thing I've seen over, over the last four games that uh, we played, uh, we we run a lot of people in and out, and that's good for him. Fresh legs late in the fourth, they're gonna give him six on the carry. We'll call it second and four, and they'll spot the ball. Looks like at the 38 yard line of the Red Devils. Dunn goes in motion. Hillis. Hands it off again. He's hitting the backfield. He'll lose maybe one on that. Yep. We'll bring down third down and about five. So now we'll bring, we'll get fresh legs in there. And here comes the Tigers looking at their third and five. Looks like a uh, heavy set here. Uh, Nard, uh, Shamarian, Nard is in. He's usually only on the defensive side of the ball, so good to see him getting some snaps on the offensive side of the ball. And they will. They'll run it out. They're going to run out of the Wildcat. That is done, and they're going to get the Tigers right. for a false start. That's going to push us back five yards, Ricky. Didn't need that. Going to no. up third down and nine. Yeah, we tried to hurry up and just, you know, got just a little too quick. Yep. But we was running out. Now they'll check back Hillis back in at quarterback. Throwing situation. Uh, yeah. And now Thomas checks back in. I like the play call. Different look. We've thrown a lot of different looks out there already. You right got Dorning things. to the right. You got Dunn. Looks like Luter to the left. Single back is Thomas. And Hillis awaits the snap. He'll look at the defense. Get the play from coach from sideline. Play clock at 12 again. He'll snap it around the midfield, and he's looking to throw. He does. He airs it out. It is intercepted. Looks like he overthrew him. And they will knock him down at the 33-yard line where the Tigers turn it over. That was, First turnover uh, of the game. Was number 33, Ryder McGregory. Just overthrow that one a little bit. but uh, Yeah, yeah he, had, he had him open. Just threw it over, overthrew him a little bit. Parker will bring him up. Um, Parker Frost will bring the Red Devils to the line. And like I said, they are uh, be their first possession for the night. The single running back will be Billings. And he's going to be brought back, I think, behind the line of scrimmage. Are they going to give him some forward progress? He's going to gain about one. I think that was uh, Ghost in the ball carrier. Cameron Ghost. So it's going to bring up a second and nine. Clock on the move. 8.35 remaining in the first. No score. Frost works out a shotgun I think, and their uh, flags. The Red Devils jumped. I tell you what. So uh, they're, gonna, they're a little antsy too. 
That's going to push them back five yards. That's going to bring up a second down and 14 for the Red Devils. That young man, they've got him at 6'2", 230. And uh, the running back, Ghosting, man, he is a, he's a senior. Their uh, quarterback is a freshman. And that will back him up second and 14. And they'll spot the ball back. Looks like at the 28-yard line, he'll work out of the shotgun and hands it to the big man. And he'll get maybe three, and maybe Bryce maybe Moore. the penalty yards back. Bryce Moore on the tackle. He's going to gain about, uh, got his penalty yards back. So, going to bring up third down and nine. And like I said, the ball now spotted at the 33-yard line of Lawrence County. Yeah. We Lawrence need, County moving left to right on your dial. Need a stop right here and get the ball back. Yes, good for field position at this point. Ghost in the single back. They'll split two receivers to the left, single to the right. Frost will work out a shotgun. He's looking to throw, and he does. He airs it out, and he's he got his he's receiver, got and he's, he's down the middle one. of the field. No flags. That's Johnson on the catch. That's like a 40-yard pass a play right there. Yep. It's going to be a first down for the Red Devils area in the Tiger territory. And that's going to bring up first down and 10. Ball now spotted at the Tigers' 34-yard line. Just, hey, just raised, raised up and hit him, you know, going across the middle. Yeah, didn't need much time. And they'll split two either side now. Single back, is a ghost in, and they hand it to him up the middle. He's a big back. Yes, he is. He'll pick up maybe three yards on the carry. He's brought down by a host of Tigers. Peyton Hurd in on that. Tyler Thompson in on that. And now they bring up a, they're going to officially give him four yards on the carry, bring up second and six now. Ball spotted at the 36-yard line. 31-yard line of the Tigers. They work out of the shotgun. And a busted play, and the Tigers yeah, have him in the backfield. Sacked. He's going to lose about, about eight yards, it looks like, on the play, Ricky. Looked like a was busted that, play from the from the get-go, and the Tigers was ready for it. Was that done on the tackle? I couldn't see. And that's going to bring up a third and ten. I think it was done on the – now the ball is spotted at the Third 36. Clock on the move, 6.04 remaining in the first. Still no score. They're going to split two receivers to the right. Single, and they hand it to the big man trying to get out to the side. He's not going to go. He'll break one tackle, two tackles, and they finally wrestle him down at the 30-yard line. It's going to be short of the tough. first down. Going to bring up a Sanchez fourth down tackle. and about six. And looks like we'll have timeout on the field. It's going to be a heat timeout, uh, Ricky, and I think we're going to take a timeout with them. We'll be right back on the AHS Sports Network. Lawrence County, they're 0-2, mm -hmm. uh, but I will tell you they're probably going to be the best football team we've faced thus far. Oh, yeah. They're going to they're be able to match us physically. Um, you know, they, they do a really – they're going to be big. They do a good job with their scheme. They also have a new coach, which is in these first four or five ball games about the yeah. – you know, all of us are new, I guess. Yeah. Um, but, you know, Lawrence County has a rich tradition of, of – of And we're back here at Lawrence County High School where the Tigers are trying to make a stop right here. It's fourth down and six. And here comes the Red Devils. They'll split two receivers to the left, two to the right. Single back is ghosting. Frost will take it out of the shotgun, and he's looking to throw. And he will air one out down the sideline. And good defense, but what a great catch. He had a lot of time to throw it, too. 
He looks like he may be inside the 20, no flags. He's got a first down. That's a 15, Fountain on the catch. That's gonna move the chains. He's right and outside. Looks like they're gonna spot it at the 15 yard line of the Tigers. Tigers now need to get in there and let's disrupt this play. They'll split a one way out to the left, two to the right. They'll work with the two back. And they hand it to the big man and he's hit immediately. Nowhere to go. That's uh, Hayden Durham. That's what you call filling a hole Brody right there. Dunn. Bryce Moore in on the tackle. <laughs> Got number 62 checking in for Ardmore. Don't know who that is tonight. That's not on our roster. We will maybe, get maybe, we will get that mass man. Maybe Vickers. And now they'll bring it back up. They're gonna split them both two each way. And the single back now, they'll hand it to him. And he'll bounce off of one, but not for long. Down by that was Sanchez. Williams, Austin Williams, the ball carrier. They got some big backs, Ricky. Both of their backs, are the two guys I've seen in the backfield, a load. Yeah, they and, and we're doing the right thing. We're catching them before they get ahead of steam. Oh, yeah. And uh, we're filling that hole. Now it's going to bring up. Third down. It's like a third and six. Ball spotted inside the 15, and he's looking to throw, and he will. He'll dump one out to the left, and, and our, he's open. Uh, yep. And he'll dive into the end zone for a touchdown. Our cornerback looked like he slipped down over there. That was Johnson. And that was Johnson. That's two catches for Johnson on that drive. And the Red Devils come down the field and put it in the end zone uh, for the Red Devils. He scores six to nothing. Looks like the Red Devils are lining up uh, for the point after. Williams, but Williams lining up for the kick. The kick is up. And it is good. So after Ardmore comes out, opening drive, gets the ball, moves the ball well. We throw an interception uh, deep into the Red Devil territory. They come right down the field and score and moving with a little under five minutes to go in the first quarter. Red Devils lead the Armour Tigers, seven to nothing. We'll be right back on the AHS Sports Network. County comes in, kick off to the Tigers back deep. For the Tigers, hey, we, you know, we got Luter. We got to make something happen. Uh, Sanchez got the last one. Hey, yeah, good field position. We drove the ball good. We just got to finish on this drive, Greg. Yep. And they get ready to kick it. And uh, it's Luter. Is that Daly's going to take it? Daly. Yeah, Daly comes across, and he's got a little opening up the middle. And he's up almost 40, 45, and he's all the way up midfield. Great job. Good job. We're going to have the ball near midfield on our own 49-yard line, first down and 10. Good starting position, field position. For That's the exactly what we needed right there. Now let's get that. They're going to spot it at the Tigers' 48-yard line, first down and 10. And here comes the offense. We and moved the ball pretty good. We would have a play here or there where we'd get stopped in the backfield on that first drive, and that put put us behind the chains and forced us to throw the ball. Kind of got us in trouble that first drive. So looking forward to seeing what we're going to do here. The train's and got the ball. And now Hillis hands the ball off, and he'll have He's two yards. Have, I think that's about, they're going to give him about four, Ricky. Ah, the ball carry was the Thomas. 42 coasting on the carry. He's going to give him, they're going to give him about three Looks yards. Looks like Zach Hall has checked into the game, too. Going to bring up second down and seven. And they will spot the ball inside Lawrence County territory, and he's going to hand it to the big man, and he finds a he crease. A He'll cut. get around 45, in down to the 43, close to a first That's down. Be close to a first down, Ricky. He'll come up maybe a half yard short. Third down. 
I mean, it, it might be a foot. The, short. the chains are right here in front of us, and it looks like I it's think I would take a measurement right here. That's that's awful close. And they yeah, are. They are. I mean, that's awful close right there. Referees are going to call. You know, because I mean, everybody said, "Well, it's third down." You know, yeah. whatever. You know, hey, fumble anything right here, man. Yeah. But the if it's things. they're going to give them first down. Well, so guess what? It's an AHS Sports Network first, first down. down. So they will move the chains for the Tigers. Tigers now on the move. And they'll fill the back field up now, Dunn. Is that call and Dunn in on, on the, the right play? side? And they'll wait for the official to start the uh, play clock. Luckily, because we had jumped. Yeah, and Thomas now, he busted up in the middle. He's going to have positive yardage five anyway. Dust. A cloud of dust in five yards. Hey, Ricky, do that three times. That's a first down. Every time. Hold on to he, the ball, ball gained, control. He actually gained six. Colston checks out. Coverdale checks in. Coverdale is a hard runner also. If you watched the game last week, he had 25 carries for, I think, is 185 yards and four touchdowns. So he's a very capable running back as well. I think he's got. A, he's a little quicker than Colston. Uh, doesn't have the weight and, and a little easier to bring down than Colston, but two good backs. Anyway, it will bring up a, a second and five ball now spotted. Ricky and I don't inside have, the thirty. Yeah, Ricky and I don't have spot, uh, spotters like uh, Kurt. Hurt no, Street we don't have a, a, a monitor right yeah. in front of us. Yeah, and we are calling it from the stands of yeah. uh, this game. But boy, it feels so it's, much cooler. It's fantastic out here. Beautiful tonight. night. Temperatures about probably right now about seventy-five degrees. And Cloverdale no will be no the single wind. back. Hillis working out of the shotgun. They'll hand it to Cloverdale, and Cloverdale's got room. He'll have a first down. Cloverdale hits that hole quick and gets to the chains. That's going to be enough to move the chains. Tigers are moving the ball. And doing exactly, exactly what you do when, right. when, when the other team scores. you got to go down and match it. Yes, sir. And the ball's inside the black and gold zone at the 19-yard line. Tigers will work from the middle of the field. And now the train's back in there, coasting the single back. They'll work from a tight formation, loaded to the left side. And now Dunn will motion over to the right. And they hand the ball. They fake it That's off. Fake. And now he's Hillis got, got, got right open in the end zone. Let's go! Luter! It is a touchdown by Luter. Cruz Luter. And just Heck like that, the Tigers on a 20-yard strike. Hey, beautiful play design. The play action to Colston uh, going right. Had the whole defense going right. Looter slipped out the backside, ran a little uh, deep flag route to the outside, 